Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day on the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Don't make assumptions and don't overdo. Always do your best, but don't overdo. When you overdo, you deplete the body and you go against yourself, and it will take longer to accomplish your goals. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 274, NASDAQ up 215, SP is up 54. Gold, gold contract up trading up $30 at $23.90. We got silver up a buck seventeen, $29.87 an ounce, light sweet crude. Up 75 cents, seventy-eight dollars seventy-seven cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. A ten-year note, up 20 ticks, trading 109.23. The 30-year up a full point, plus eight ticks at 118.01. And King Dollar, King Dollar, and its lower trading range right now, down 677 ticks at 104.336. Euro is at 108. Yen is at 154. British pound is at 126 to one U.S. dollar. Our phone number is 877. 9276648. Give us a call, folks. I know what's going on in your world. In the world of the SPs, let's take a look at it. Well, we're at all time highs. Bottom line, we're not going to get the volume of the first high. We're going to get the volume of the second high. So, the way this is set up, folks, is that your first high out here, we had uh, 96 million. Well, no, 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 I see. I, this is an, Oh, this is interesting, man. Yeah. And it failed. Okay, well, we had 96 million. You only had 36 right now. Inside the Qs, we take a look at the Qs. What you're going to see with the Qs, that was the one with the first one versus the second one. The first high out here, yeah, there it is here. So the first high had 72 million at 448. The second one where it failed had 39. Now, we're going to do 39. We're already at 30. So we'll see where this shakes out. Right now, the way this is set up is that it's not backing out at all, zero. And you're going to see why. When we go over to the good old U.S. dollar, you know, the dollar has been hanging tough. You know, we had the CPI came out this morning, bottom line. You know, it was a light CPI, which got this baby going. So inside of the dollar, you're dealing with 104,976. And this is a good one, man, because this is a wide price spread bar. This is the second one we got. We got one about a week and a half ago that just rejected lower price. Bottom line, that sets up the dollar going down to the 102, 380, and we'll see how it handles that, and then the 100. So if that's what we get, you are going to see some big action here, man, uh, in the market, even though we've had big action. <laughs> we go over to the gold market. The gold market right now is taking out a swing point. Not going to have enough volume for an ABC structure up, but it has that high volume spike up there at 2448. That's where we're going. And then notes and bonds. If we take a look at note and bond, you're going to see this quite clearly. These are ABC structures up. They're beauties, man. Plenty of volume, all of the above. We got 2.3 uh, 2 million contracts inside the 10-year. You're blowing away the swing point. The swing point that we're blowing away. There we go. So the swing point that we're blowing away is the uh, 2.8 million. Oh, no. Bummer. Huh, interesting. No, it's not going to be an ABC up either. Yeah, no, it's 2.8 million contracts on the 10-year. And right now we're at the 2.3. Bottom line, my take is that higher price, lower yields are going to continue to come at us. Let's go to Steve in Maryland. Hey, Steve, what's going on, brother? Hey, Tom, how are you doing? I'm doing great, man. Yourself? I'm doing, I'm doing good, yeah. I'm doing real good, Tom. Good. <laughs> are you still practicing yoga? I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. No. You're not. Oh. I haven't well, been. No. Yeah. Well, but that was. Is it, it's never, never too late to to get back into it. No, so. that's for sure. That's for sure. So, so we're going to look at super microcomputer. The low for the year is one thirty-five. The high is twelve twenty-nine. Okay. So, talk to me. Well, when I talked to you uh, back in February, it had gone hyperbolic and it had a big sell-off. But it's been building cause for several months here. And, um, you know, I do my float analysis. Yes. And it um, and, uh, looks to me like it's moving higher. What are you, what's your take? What, what is the 
problem to me is that, you know, and I remember when you're calling, okay, yeah. the, the first time that, you know, it came down February 15th, it came off the high with volume. It went to a higher high, but it only had 11 million shares versus that first high of 34 million. Yep. You know, so it's, it's, it's dicey right now, man. I mean, that's, you know, today's a real good day. There's no doubt. It's up 120 bucks. And it, it definitely did break the downtrend. You know, you get that wide bar and you get an acceleration of volume. So it's, it's really going to be, Steve, how it handles like the 2020. Uh, no, 1,020. Right. And where I'm going with that, you probably see it on Target TV. That was, you know, that's another down day. I'm, I'm just kind of, that's kind of almost like iced. You know what I'm saying? So. Yeah, exactly. And, and what you're going to have, no doubt, is NVIDIA. I mean, this trades off NVIDIA. So NVIDIA yeah. comes out with their numbers on the 22nd of May. And, you know, that's going to make a big difference, man. And NVIDIA yeah. looks good today. And NVIDIA has a high volume high, man. My take on NVIDIA is that it is going to 974. So if that's what you get, you're going to probably still get some good actions. You know what I mean? Yep. Yeah. Yep. It looks, it looks good to me, Tom. Yeah. So I just wanted to, you know, also I wanted to say that your analysis, I just have loved your analysis. I used it all these years, you know. Well, I appreciate I, it. I listened to you so many times at our workshops, and, um, you know, I, I just picked up a whole lot from that. So Nice. So Haytesville, right? Where is that in relationship? No, it's, it's uh, Hyattsville. 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 So where is yeah. that in relationship to Solomon's Island? No, well, I'm inside the Beltway. I got it. Okay, I got it. Yeah, I, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a suburb of D.C. No, I'm with you. No, I got it. I was at, I was at Solomon's Islands over the weekend. It was amazing, man. That, y your trees up there are beautiful, man. They're all like 100 feet tall, man. Oh, yeah. we've got a lot of nature up here. Yeah, Tom, with you the, do. With the bay and all the rivers. and. No, um, no doubt, man. It's, it's, it's a lot of gorgeous territory. It, it's gorgeous. Seriously, man. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, man. Well, listen, you have a great one and a safe one. Thanks for the call, man. All righty. You're welcome. You take care. Bye -bye. Awesome, man. Stay right there, folks. Uh, coming back with uh, Elliot uh, uh, well and back, Elliot is the Senior Vice President Institutional ETF Strategist at Direction. We are coming right back, folks. If you spend any time online researching trading techniques on how to begin your trading journey, you've no doubt come across many folks who push Forex trading as a way to make big money quickly. Unfortunately, there are equally as many stories of these so-called Forex professionals just looking to make a quick buck off aspiring traders without actually teaching the ins and outs of the Forex market. This is what sets Teddy Kekstack's The Tiger Forex Report off the riffraff. Every Monday, former Chicago Mercantile Exchange member and author Teddy Kekstad releases his Tiger Forex Report newsletter, where he dives into the complex world of Forex and takes time to actually teach you his methods that have made him so successful in the fast-paced and rewarding world of Forex trading. Furthermore, all subscribers receive access to archived live streams of Teddy's, where he provides university-level education to help you in Forex trading. All first-time subscribers receive a 30-day money-back guarantee. So what are you waiting for? Forex awaits. The stock market is a delicate, interconnecting web of commodities, equities, and trader psychology. When one string of the web is pulled, it has a ripple effect across the broader market. This is where opportunity lies. But how are you to gather all of this information into one cohesive model when you're already spending your energy looking for any possible trade opportunities? Luckily, you don't have to worry about that, as Tom O'Brien has brought all important market news to you in one single newsletter, Market Insights. Market Insights provides a daily overview of what's happening in the indexes, bonds, gold, and more. Follow along with Tom daily as he analyzes the components that affect the overall movement of the stock market, giving insight into how each one plays either a bullish or bearish role. Tom also analyzes specific equities that he believes has the potential to make huge returns, and his track record proves his analysis right. All first-time subscribers receive a 30-day money-back guarantee. So what are you waiting for? Don't let the market leave you in the dust. Are you ready to take charge of your financial future? TFNN is your gateway to the world of trading and investing. Whether you're starting out or scaling up, TFNN empowers traders and investors of all skill levels with top-notch investing systems, strategies, and techniques. It's time to protect and grow your money with insight you can trust. 
Join us live Monday through Friday during market hours for exclusive content that moves with the markets. At TFNN, we bring the truth.